fantastic. But in Canada, there is no country capital. There is, however, a large group of Calgarians pulling for the Stampede City to have the honors. Jamie Wall reports. When you think of country music in Canada, the Calgary Stampede comes instantly to mind. Calgary is already the unofficial capital of country music, and now the Calgary Country Music Association is lobbying to make it official. Before his performance tonight, American country star Ronnie Millsap held a press conference to lend his support. Calgary's country music fans have always been good to me and my fellow entertainers. That's why I encourage you to lend your support to Country Music Week in Calgary, September 89. The association is proposing that starting in 1989, Calgary should be the permanent home of the annual Country Music Week, which is a convention for country music industry people and its fans, and also for the Canadian Country Music Hall of Fame and Museum. According to spokeswoman Pam Barker, Calgary is the ideal city for housing these attractions. But we are saying we have all these facilities, all these advantages. We have the audience, we have the opportunities, we have the center, for example. We have all this we can offer to the betterment and the benefit of all the Canadian country music industry. Other cities are competing with similar bids, but Barker knows that Calgary has one advantage that other Canadian cities don't. Country music here is an accepted art form. Uh, it's reached a level of acceptance here far beyond any other city in the country. You wouldn't have the Bar Association of Toronto insisting they have either Dick Dameron or Diamond Joe White at their year-end wrap-up. The association will give their presentation at this year's Country Music Week, held next month in Winnipeg. Jamie Wall, CFCN News.